of Red Kilty as sponsors, man in the match, but I'm sure you'll agree that the win was down to a great team effort today. Yeah, um, I think there could have been a lot of man of the matches, to be honest. Uh, I think a few of the boys were giving me a bit of stick for, for getting it, so um, no, that's, that's, a, that's a great performance that we've put on there. And I think it's down to all the lads as a collective, and, and you've probably seen it during the week, and it's been taken on day to day. Yeah, it was a similar game to Tuesday night against Arbroath. Had to be patient. They made it difficult for you in the first half, but a bit of quality shown through in the second half. Yeah, um, Tuesday night the same, just stuffy in the first half. But we always felt that we were on top, and then um, in the second half, I know basically, yeah, quality in the front areas got us the goals, and, and that was it. From your own point of view, <coughs> managers have been asking you to play predominantly wide in the left, but with some scope to come inside and make a nuisance of yourself. Yeah, um, since he came in, uh, since I came in, sorry, um, he was kind of saying about playing through the middle, but um, just the way that the the squad's kind of shaped up in the team, um, he's asked me to go and do a job on the left, and to be honest, the first few games, uh, I wasn't sure about positions, but um, as you can see, the games went on, I've adapted, and, and all, it's, it's been really good, and, and with the boys, it, they've helped me, and um, finally got creating chances and to be honest I didn't know I'd have as much license I think I pop up on the right quite a lot as, <laughs> as the left but that's down to um, Andy Ryan and and Nizzy because they fell in on the left and we just kind of spell it if, if you see. Yeah, you also were on the receiving end of a few hefty challenges, uh, maybe expect that but probably a compliment that they see you as a danger. Yeah, uh, that's just part and parcel I, I think if you're, if you're losing and and somebody's uh, gone past you, it's, it's a case I'd take them down. But yeah, as you're right, just take it as a compliment and, and get up and get on with it. Yeah, so the, the loan spell from Kilmarnock, it's a chance to get you playing regular football. You've had spells out in loan before, a brief spell with today's opponents coming to the south, but I take it you're, you're happy with the way things are going here so far this season? Yeah, that was a while ago, the Queen of South one, yeah. yeah. But, um, no, it's, as I said, I just wanted to get back out of the pitch and, and start playing again, and, and I've been absolutely delighted since I came in to get the minutes that I've got and and obviously the team uh, is doing really well now so um, we just want to keep pushing up the table and pushing into the playoff positions. Yeah, aim to keep the momentum going but uh, we're two games away from home now so uh, maybe same approach though, is it home or away or what, what do you reckon? Of course, uh, I think you went to every game wanting to win. I think uh, away from home in this league it's, it's different, uh, everybody understands it's, it's a tough league to go away and um, teams make it hard for you, but that's, and that's at the end of the day, I, don't, I think if, if we went in with a team we've got not expecting to win, or at least go and give it a go, then there'd be something wrong. And a goal provider today, but you'll be looking to get on the score sheet yourself in the weeks to come. I think Nizzy should have scored that one to me when he scored. <laughs> but uh, no, I'm just delighted that the, the boys have scored, and um, Ryan Dow took his chance excellently when I put it across. But no, it was, as I say, as long as somebody's scoring and we're winning, then, then I'm happy. Good stuff. Thanks, Greg. Thank you very much. Thank you.